Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of How to Play. It's Tomb Raider. Got a bow. Got some fire arrows. Got a very old gun. Got a pistol. Ooh, rabbit. I'm gonna blame the frame rate. Because this game requires a lot from your machine. Okay, so I'm good with a bow, but not with a gun. That says a lot about me. Okay, so I just killed an animal. I might as well show you uh, some basic things. So let's just jump down. If anyone's played Far Cry, then... This might remind, you of this. Might remind them of some... Elements from Far Cry. Alright, so I have I have survival instinct ability. What you have to do is just press Q, and then what you see is everything in grey. The reason why he's glowing is because I don't actually I, I never use this when like I first started playing the game. Oh, by the way, this is with everything fully upgraded. Never started um, using this one on people when I first started playing the game. So I don't know if it was because I upgraded it that he's glow glowing. Or not, but either way, he's gonna die. Apparently not, because there we go. Wait, there are other people here. What? Why should we toil alone? Oh, what the fuck are you talking about now? It's a poem. Yeah, I don't get it. Sometimes you get dialogue. Like that. And then their friends die. And the only thing you can do is just laugh. Damn it. <laughs> Alright, so I was able to zoom by just pressing Z. It's not mouse scroll up or mouse scroll down because that just changes weapons. Let's change it to my gun with a silencer. Yeah, it's actually harder for me to use the pistol because I barely did anything with it. But because of my fuck up, I can show you the melee combat. Just press F and you just hack him to death. Ooh, damn! Don't try to kill me. Hey, wolf. Or some kind of dog. Nah. Alright, so... <laughs> There's actually a bunch of collectibles in this game. Right, that, that thing right there. That is a challenge. And you can do that challenge. And then you get XP for it. So I'm just going to demonstrate. I, th I, I think I might have left that one alone because I was never because I was like I need to finish the game at some point. Oh wait, I did light it up. Never mind then. So let's just light this up then. Things that are, in, that are just with a bunch of like ink, white cloth, uh, primarily that rabbit is crazy. Oh, he fixed himself. What you get for fixing yourself. Damn rabbit. I am a horrible person. I just killed a rabbit for no reason. Oh, that's a boar. That's what it was. Press Q again, and then you can just see the boar and loot. The hell is that thing? Oh, great. It's one of those things I can examine. You find these these are one of the other collectible things that you find and they just give you XP. Like a journal and these relics give you twenty five XP and everything else which is a challenge just gives you ten. And honestly, it's 
pretty fucking pointless. And that's my Facebook again. I am very bad at this. Even if you uh, just move it about. Marks represent friends lost or enemies killed. Either way, you needed a drink. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. Wow. 50 friends die, then uh, that's pretty bad. I'm not going to show you any of that. Uh, you can also find journals, but honestly, there's really no point. Unless you want some sort of backstory with the characters. Oh, but fuck. Come back here, you. I'm going to get you. Yeah, ammo is not scarce. Like, if you think ammo is scarce in this game, then, uh kind of stupid because really in my playthrough I was like I'm gonna use every bullet I have and I always got maxed out with the ammo capacity again in like five minutes because I found a bunch of ammo so it was it's actually pretty easy uh, let's see what else can oh yeah I never show this off all right so if I hold middle mouse button I'm able to fire a different kind of arrow. That's called a rope arrow. And that's all it does. Oh yeah, that back. Look at those scars. And a campfire. Alright, campfires are your save points. There's actually nothing else to campfires but that. Oh, they hurt you. Alright, so in a campfire you're able to upgrade skills, so you got like three different trees to go from, you got survivor, hunter, and brawler. Brawler is your melee, as you can see it gives you a list of things you have and things you don't have, and your percentage of how much of it's completed. Hunter, there was a point when I just didn't care anymore and just killed everyone. Alright, so uh, there's also Okay, so I got scraps, which I scavenged, and I'm able to spend that on upgrading uh, weapons. So, let's just upgrade the bow with an ex... Damn it, why can't I... Oh, sh That's annoying. Like, here's me going like, yeah, I'll show you guys how, like, how what, like, what an explosive arrow is like. No, I can't now. Let's just show you the grenade launcher being upgraded. You you want a boom? I'll give you a boom. Cause you know what? Booms are good. Boom. Oh wait, I think I should look away before anything happens. Uh, there we go. Yeah. It's really all I can say about Tomb Raider. I mean, it's not that complex a game. Uh, when it. When I first got it, I was like, okay, I know there are so many things to do, but what are they going to bottom map the uh, the silencer and the fire arrows? And then it turned out to be the same key for everything else. Anyway, th this has been Tomb Raider, and uh, yeah, I'll see you guys next time.